Well, they're going to get it. <laughs> you know, there's no doubt about that. And um, I can say we probably feel the exact same way. You know, um, you know, obviously both teams want to win a title. Um, but I think both teams are happy they're playing the team they're playing. I think it's uh, exactly the way uh, we envision it um, doing uh, training camp. And it's probably the same way they envision it. You know, so um, that's good. Yeah, so you said to you. Well, I, I welcome it. Uh, I mean, it's, it's a great opportunity. It'll be a lot of fun. Um, I, again, I think it's what both teams want. Um, you know, uh, I jokingly told someone the champ's going to win. You said the other day that yeah. your starting five still hasn't lost from two years ago. How much has that driven you? That's driven us, all of us. You know, um, we didn't have that opportunity last year. And, uh, you know, the Lakers won, but we didn't have the opportunity because we were injured. Uh, and honestly, we wasn't playing great anyway, but we were not injured. So, um, you know, but now we're a little different than that team, obviously. You know, the starting five is the same, but we have a different bench. We have different guys, and so do they. Um, you know, 2008 was 2008. Um, not going to live on that a whole bunch, I can tell you that. Um, the Lakers are a much better basketball team, and uh, I'm hoping we are too. Doc, Doc, Doc you did you the, did you tell did Paul tell the team I'm going home to LA? I'd like you guys to come with me though. Yeah, well, we knew that, and so did Kevin, because Kevin lives in Malibu. So, oh, okay. uh, you know, we didn't know, you know, at that time if LA would be there or not. You know, with Phoenix in the series, but we did. We have that. We assumed that, like everyone else did. So, um, what do you think it means to Paul to go back home again for the finals? Well, I just think it means. It's important to Paul. I think it's important to everybody, um, you know, to be there, uh, to try to win another one is, is really important for all of us. Doc, are you playing your best defense? You felt it was, when it was Celtics-Lakers, it was your responsibility to beat the Lakers. How does that, how did that kind of come about for you? Well, I don't, you know, it's just your responsibility to win the series, you know. It, let's say if you're playing Phoenix, it would be that same responsibility, you know, as, as a group. Uh, and, and what I was saying is, you know, Celtics Lakers mean more uh, to each guy because of the, the history. Even the young guys know the history. So uh, you feel like when you're a Celtic, you want to defend the Celtics, and they feel like when they're Lakers, they want to de defend the Lakers. So, uh, but it's no more than that. One of the things I told our guys is once the game starts, it's about playing basketball. And at the end of the day, that's, it's going to be the team that has the best focus, uh, that follows their game plan the best. Uh, that has the best resolve. Uh, those are the things that's going to win this series. Uh, the history stuff will that'll that'll happen. You know, all the other stuff is going to be done on the floor. Doc, any concern about Perkins being one tech away? And do you have to talk to him about keeping? Him? <clears throat> well, clearly my talks haven't worked yet. So uh, you know, maybe I should have another one. Uh, no, I'm concerned by it honestly because I, I, what I'm concerned by with this is that it's going to be a physical series. All right, and um, there's going to be guys that get tangled up under the basket, um, and then uh, there's going to be officials who are going to want to uh, clean the game up, and you know, Perk may be in that, and the double technical. That's why I've been on it for a month now. This double technical thing should not be part of the seven uh, techs. It really shouldn't be, but it is, and it's a factor. Uh, and I wouldn't be surprised if it's a factor in this.